hey guys welcome back to another video i know it has been quite a while since i last posted on here i've been away learning and you know doing some new stuff so i can come back here and share the knowledge that i have learned with you guys now i should start being consistent again but in this video i will be going over mistakes that almost every trader makes that is costing you money causing you to consistently blow your accounts or just make trading not worth your while in general now based on my experience these mistakes are made by traders whether you're a beginner intermediary or they can just be made by anyone whether you're trading in crypto forex or the stock market so let's jump right into it and as i said i will be coming back consistent so if you are new here please do go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get right into it number one lack of a solid trading plan one of the most critical mistakes a lot of traders made is diving into the markets without a well thought out trading plan now a solid trading plan should outline what your goals are your risk tolerance as well as your preferred trading strategy and your money management rules without a trading plan a lot of traders often act on impulse and emotions leading to poor decision making and financial losses now developing a comprehensive trading plan and actually sticking to it can help traders remain disciplined and focused during even turbulent market conditions number two ignoring risk management another grave mistake a lot of traders make is underestimating the importance of risk management proper risk management is essential to preserve capital and ensure longevity in the trading game so factors such as over leveraging failing to set stop loss orders or just risking too much capital on a single trade are common errors that traders should avoid implementing appropriate risk reward ratios and position size strategies can help mitigate potential losses and overall just protect your trading accounts number three chasing losses experiencing losses is an inevitable part of trading regardless of how good a trader is there is no one who can accurately time the market or predict the market 100 percent of the time However, a common mistake many traders make is actually chasing after their losses, hoping to recoup their money quickly. This behavior can lead to a destructive cycle of emotional decision making, which often results in even more significant losses. All traders should learn to accept losses as a part of the learning process and follow their trading plan diligently rather than allowing emotions to dictate your actions. Number four lack of education and continuous learning trading is a skill that requires constant learning and adoption beginner traders often make the mistake of thinking they can achieve instant success without investing in education and gaining a deep understanding of the financial market that they are trading in and this has become even more popular over the years with a lot of get rich quick schemes or gurus on youtube saying that um, trading is very easy and it's something that you can make a quick book from and that is quite the opposite keeping up with market trends studying technical and fundamental analysis and learning from experienced traders insights are all crucial steps in becoming a successful trader number four over trading the temptation to be constantly active in the market can lead to over trading a mistake that can erode profits and increase your overall transaction costs. Overtrading often results from boredom, the fear of missing out, or just overall impatience. Most successful traders understand the importance of patience and discipline and waiting for high probability trading setups rather than placing trades impulsively. And this is something that happened to me quite a lot um, when I just started out trading, and this caused me to actually blow a lot of accounts. And this often happens when you are either on a high losing streak or a high winning streak when you're on a high winning streak you'll always want to jump back in to try and get a next win or when you're on, on a, a high losing streak you're always going to want to you know find the next trade to help you to make your money back and that should always be avoided regardless of the mood that you're in you should always stick to your trading plan and know when enough is enough for the day number six disregarding market sentiment market sentiment actually plays a significant role in price movement 
ignoring market sentiments or failing to understand the broader market context is a mistake that can lead to poor trading timing and execution. All traders should always stay informed about economic activities, geopolitical developments, or investor sentiment to make a more informed trading decision. And this is something that I have actually experienced a lot in my time trading. Whenever I would have a certain strategy and I'm wondering why doing backtesting this strategy was successful, but in the actual market, it isn't really working that much. So what I've actually found to be most effective is to actually trade with the market so for example if you see for if you see that there is major news that's causing a certain market to go in a, a certain direction i would always advise that you know the trading strategy that is put in place you always want to basically follow the trend and this is something that i have actually noticed a lot in my time trading so for example whenever i would have a good strategy that is well back tested and shows positive results during doing back testing when it when I actually use that same strategy in the market, for example, if there is major news that is causing a certain trading symbol to be falling, regardless of how good your strategy is, if the overall market sentiment is that it is bearish on that certain signal, then it would not be advised to actually try and get a bullish trade from that. Rather, you're going to actually try and stay with the direction of that market. And at number seven, we have emotional trading. So emotions are actually going to be your worst enemy as a trader. Fear and greed often drive impulsive decisions, leading to losses in a lot of cases. The most successful traders remain emotionally detached from their trades, relying on their trading plan and strategy rather than reacting emotionally to market fluctuations. And what I do usually recommend in these cases and what I do personally to try to avoid emotional trading. So whenever I have a solid trading plan and I decide to enter a trade, I would just go ahead and completely close down my computer, close out trading view and MetaTrader. And I would not come back to that trade until I think a good amount of time has passed where I would be out of that trade. So once you have a solid trading plan, I advise that you never try to jump out of that trade unless it actually hits your take profit level or your stop loss. So in conclusion, becoming a consistently successful trader requires a lot of discipline, education and the ability to control your emotions. By avoiding these common mistakes, traders can improve their odds of success in the competitive world of trade, developing a well-defined training plan, implementing proper risk management, continuously learning and maintaining emotional discipline are essential steps towards achieving long-term profitability and financial independence as a trader. So if you learned anything from this video, please go ahead and hit that like button and also go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are new here and you want to keep updated and I'll see you guys next week.